Hey guys, it's Amanda. Um, sorry, my hair is all cuckoo cabana. Um, it's super muggy out here, so let's see. Muggy grossness. Ew. Ugh. Anyway, um, I just wanted to do a quick update because um, I miss you guys and I haven't really been that much involved with the YouTube community. Um, for that matter, even the eating disorder community, like anywhere online. Um, I do like a couple posts like here and there on, um, on like Facebook groups for eating disorders. There's one called, um, I think it's anorexia, bulimia, and, and nose recovery or whatever. I can't remember what it's called. Um, but yeah, I do some posts on there, but that's about it. So I've been pretty MIA for the last, I want to say probably like four years, if I'm being completely honest with myself. Like before I went off to college, I posted every single day and I was like, hi guys. Like Y'all know my entire life story. Um, but since college and not college, I haven't really posted much. Um, just because, like, shit got real, real fucking fast. Um, basically, if y'all don't already know, um, I ended up dropping out of college because I um, needed help with the eating disorder and I thought I was getting help for the eating disorder but it turns out that instead of getting help for what I needed help with I was getting help for drug and al alcohol addiction we so that happened um, that was fun because my parents I guess couldn't afford eating disorder treatment so they put me in there thinking that you know as long as I got some kind of treatment I would get better um, which was not the case um, like yeah I've, I found out that like yes I do have a problem with alcohol and drugs and um, so now I'm sober um, but like eating disorder wise it didn't really help anything um i gained some weight um which is another reason why i hadn't been posting um because i gained weight um from like the time i went into recovery which was before college um to like just recently, like in the past year, um, I've started to like lose it again. Um, but yeah, just because like hormones and like I was trying to be recovered as fuck. And um, so I gained a shit ton of weight and then I went on a birth control pill that fucked with my weight like horribly. <laughs> So wrong it was bad um, and then I got in a super abusive abusive relationship and started like using bulimia to cope with it and in my head like I was getting all the calories out but obviously from my pictures I was not <laughs> um, so yeah it was kind of a, a clusterfuck for a while, um, but anyway, so yeah, I've lost that weight and lost more. Um, I'm lower, I'm at a lower weight than I've ever been, basically, um, except for when I was like really young and super in the anorexia. Um, I was like 60 pounds when I was younger, but like now I'm uh, now I'm like 105. 
so it's not like horrible horrible but it's like not obviously not good you know um, anyway um, so yeah other than weight shit um, but yeah I got out of treatment went to his sober house um, fucked shit up was homeless for a while then I went to my friend Michelle's house um, started using again um, and fucked that shit up so I was homeless again and then I went to an Oxford house got together with this guy fuck that up <laughs> Fucked it up so hard. Um, and then, what else happened? And then, oh yeah, and then I moved in to a room um, at uh, one of my friend's houses and like paid rent and everything. And um, got in a relationship with this super abusive motherfucker. Apparently, he is also a sex offender. Did not know that until I broke up with him. Um, moved in with my parents for a little bit. Then I moved back into that place with him, like, not in it, obviously. Um, he had moved in previously. Um, <laughs> God, my life is a mess. Anyway, and then um, I got together with... Um, my girlfriend now, um, her name is Stevie and she's lovely and gorgeous and amazing and we've been together for, shit, it'll be a year on Sunday, so we are about two days out from that. Fuck, I have to get her an anniversary gift, fuck. <laughs> anyway, um, so yeah, um got together with her, um, and was with her over the summer and lost a shit ton of weight, um, and then we broke up for a hot second, um, I don't even really call it a breakup, it was just like me and my psychotic brain going crazy, um, because the eating disorder was like, you must lose more weight. And um, I knew that she wasn't going to go for that. So I broke up with her for a little bit so I could lose more weight. Um, so yeah, that happened. And then I moved in with her. I'm still with her. Um, this is our outside porch place. It's pretty and awesome. Um, so yeah, and then I started working at a bar, um, it was like a coffee shop, like, slash, um, bar, slash, like, music venue place. I still work there, but I don't work on the bar side, thank you, Jesus. Um, now I work on the coffee side, which is a lot better for my sanity, um, uh, what else is happening? I'm reworking through the steps again, um, with a new sponsor. Um, but yeah, so now you are caught up on Amanda's life. Yay! It's been crazy. It's been a little cray-cray. Anyway, um, so yeah, I guess now to update on said eating disorder. Um... Eating disorder wise, um, still losing weight. Um, sorry, my hands are shaky. I've been drinking not star energy organic. <laughs> um, thinking that organic is better for me is probably not the best idea. Um, because it's still an energy drink, the energy drink words. They're hard sometimes. Anyway, um, so yeah, eating disorder land is not going pretty. Um, 
I got my back my period a while ago and um, so that's been happening um, and it's been fucking bullshit um, basically this entire week I'm on my period right now as we speak sorry TMI um, I have no filter as of recently um, anyway so I'm on my period and I've been in bed all day um, and for like the past fucking I don't know three four days um, I missed one day of work um, anyway so that's been rough as shit because apparently when you get your period back uh, shit goes down and you feel like you're dying all the time um, like seriously I was like puking my guts out for like the first two days um, some of it was like cause I can't like now that I've had an eating disorder for so long, um, I can't, like, I guess, puke on my own, I don't know, like, I, I can't puke unless, like, I force it to happen, and so, like, that started happening because it was like, I know I need to puke, but, like, my body won't let me, um, so that was happening. And I've actually been doing a lot better with the whole, like, binging and purging thing. Like, I haven't been doing that. Um, but, like, on my period, like, I need to puke, so I, I do. Um, it's more leaning towards the anorexia part. Um, so, yeah, anyway, um... That's kind of where I'm at with the eating disorder. Um, I updated, I think, like one time when I had like a treatment team. Um, God, this angle is fucking bullshit. Sorry. I'm trying to like figure out what is the best place so that I don't look like a huge fucking ginormous monster. Anyway, moving on. My hair looks like shit, sorry. Anyway, um, so yeah, I started seeing a treatment team for a little bit. Um, they wanted me to go to eating disorder treatment, and I was like, well, fuck, I already fucking tried that, um, like five million times when I was younger, and then when I was in college, like, I tried to do that again, but they sent me to drug and alcohol treatment because they didn't have money for it, so fuck you. Um, so basically I stopped going per the usual with me. If I don't, like, get my way, then I stop going. It's horrible. It's really bad. It's not good. Anyway, um, uh, my arms. Ooh look like they're fucking monsters. Okay, don't look at them. Don't look. Just don't look. Anyway, um, so yeah, eating disorder is more on the anorexia side and the restrictive side and the I'm going to exercise until I fall over side. Um, um, but with this whole, like, period thing, it's making me gain water weight, which is fun. Um, this entire morning I've been freaking out because it, the scale told me that I gained like three pounds in one day. Apparently it was all water retention bullshit. Um, so yeah, that's kind of where I'm at. Long ass fucking update. Sorry. Um, I'm gonna hopefully be on here more. I'm not promising anything, um, because honestly I have a life, <laughs> and I have a job, and I have a girlfriend, and 
I can't be talking to myself for hours on end like I used to. Um, when I was in high school, it was a lot easier because all I had to do was go to school, do some homework, and nothing else, so, except for talk to you guys, so, um, and I didn't have any friends, because <laughs> I was lame as fuck, no, um, I was just in the eating disorder, and people didn't like me at my school, because I was quiet and smart, so they didn't like me, anyway, god, I sound like a horrible human being, anyway, um, but yeah, hopefully I will be here soon, again, sometime in the future, so, peace.